up, everybody? Welcome back to the team, Fish Nibbles YouTube channel. So, uh, today, we got the first place list. Uh, there was people, like, posting this list that supposedly won, but they didn't have the list. But, but, someone's PC came in clutch. They're back to doing Pokemon, not just Digiman. Uh, they're back doing Pokemon, and they posted an interview, because you don't know, Drew is part of someone's PC. I'm, like, 99% sure he had a someone's PC shirt on, and Pokemon said, hey... You gotta cover that. So down below, it's gonna be a, a video, a link to that video. Watch that first. Um, it is like fifty something minutes long. They explain the deck. They explain the matchups. They explain why you shouldn't play this deck anymore and why he, Drew didn't really like it. Um, yeah, that was the big thing, right? Uh, but still, congratulations getting first place with this list. I'm trying to see. Um, what drew, I think it was just like X22, right? I'm pretty sure he like lost the two matches he talks about, wins out in, in IDs twice, I think, to make cut or something like that. Yeah. So congratulations, Drew, uh, for getting first place with a Arceus Gengar deck. Uh, an Arceus deck that we definitely did not think we would see. Uh, it's spicy stuff like the High Potion, the Collapse Stadium, and the Tool Scrapper. And uh, if you watch, if you miss, any of the matches, go check out Pokemon's YouTube channel where you can watch the matches. So, instead of me covering the list, if you want to learn about it, go watch the video. What are you doing? Go watch the video. Go watch the video. Go watch the video. Did you watch the video yet? Go tell Russell I sent you. Say, if dude, guys, do me a favor. Send, say, Russell, Fish Knuckle sent me here. I'm not going to start until you go comment that video down below saying Fish Knuckle sent me here. Just go say it. Just go say it. Why not? I scroll past the deck already. To be honest. Did you see it yet? Did you say it yet? Alright, did you tell Russell I sent you there? Okay, let's play some Arceus Gengar. Let's see how it goes. Um, very interesting deck. I, I, It looks really, really cool. Uh, there were changes that they, that they talked about. Uh, definitely probably cut in length. The charm for like probably a fourth evolution instance could be something very interesting that we could do. Uh, but I'm gonna make any changes today. We're keeping it like it is. Look at that Zamazenta coin. Lost the flip. Oh, that's okay. Yeah, right. Dude, I'm so happy someone's species back. Um, first of all, they're fantastic people. Every single one of them over there is fantastic. I love them all. So great players. I gotta go meet up Russell one time. I don't know why. Oh goodness, this is like. This is bad, probably. It's probably really bad. So, I need to collab with Russell. Just need to find... I'm just going to reach out to Russell and be like, Russell, let me come collab with you. Okay, and there's Arceus, and here's my Arceus. Yo, we got that one standing on top of that mountain, Arceus. Let's go! Okay, DTE. Okay. Um, I'm thinking this is, like, the toolbox bird deck thing. Yeah. Stonejourner, bro. Stonejourner. Okay, so... Um, I think we just like try to knock this out next turn, right? So we just do this. That's done. Yeah, unfortunately. Let's see, they have the VMAX, like, this does 200, belt, 220, uh, the 230 minus the 20, okay, there's a fighting, okay, oh, beautiful, beautiful, let's go, wait, did we take a knockout, no, we don't take a knockout, right, yeah, we don't take a knockout, 230, oh, we're gonna be, like, 10 short, yo, we're gonna be 10 short, we're going to be 10 short, right? 230 minus 20 because the DTE. Uh, that's not cool. That's not cool. I think I still want to swing into this. Right? I think I still want to swing into it. I'm going to discard a Dark and grab a Gengar. Okay. Put a Gengar in. We'll go for Trinity Nova. I think we save. I don't think there's a point of like doing the extra damage, right? Because we do 230 minus 2210. 
I'd rather just do, do the 180. So. And put the three here. One, two, three. Okay, we're both dead drawing here, but I had the better hand, I guess. Uh, we could see a mega kick for knockout, right? That would be unfortunate. But uh, so what might happen here? And then we could do act. We could do dark slumber for knockout next turn, right? Okay, so there's a mega kick for knockout. Okay, so they go down to four. We're going to send it to Gengar. Gengar's got a dark slumber for knockout. <gasps> oh, baby, there we go. What a card. What a champ. We'll do this, and let's go ahead and that B-barrel. All right, well, we could do this. Um... We can go for the Fear and Panic and do 150. Yeah. We attach a DTE here. Fear and Panic for Knockout, 150. We can knock this out next turn because it only has 180 HP. So we'll get out of four. There's Ultra Ball. There's another Ultra Ball. Can we knock out a stone during a VMAX to fall in turn? It's the only problem. We'll see what they have here because, like, yeah, they peaked us, but that peak, like, it's hurting them as well. So, we'll see what happens. Hmm. Okay. I think we go after the Stone Journer, if anything, right? I feel like it's probably the better play. If we could somehow get out, go after the Stone Journer, yeah, yeah, go after Stone Journer. Yeah, yeah, hundred percent. Yeah, so we knock out the stone journer, then we're good. So the stone journer. Yep. Big charm. Two fifty. Strong energy. Well, no, what was that? Stone energy. Okay, so they're going for the trinity charge. All right. <laughs> One. Two. So if we take a knockout we, on this, we win, right? 100%. So I'm going to have Scrapper. This. Yep. I'm going to Ultra Ball. These two. I'm going to go ahead and grab another Gengar. We'll go Gengar. Put a... Don't put the DTE here. Yeah, I think the DTE here is fine. Go for industrial sizers. I'll put the DT here, so... No! Whiffed it! Oh, no. Uh-oh. Other oh, Arceus is not in the deck either. Uh-oh. Well, I should have put... Dang. Hmm. Okay, well, we're in trouble now. This does 300, so it doesn't knock us out. The next age might, though. Hmm. Hmm. There's Arceus. The Dark Energy. Okay. So the Hidden Knockout got out of one. Okay, the first supporter card played by either player. Let's go. Ah, okay, let's see what we find. Okay. So that's a knockout now. Uh, yeah, I don't know how we win now. Mm. Hmm. If I had Tatch Energy here, I could actually take a knockout with the Raihan. Probably. But oh, we're down five energies. There's only three left. Well, I we got one and right on. <gasps> hmm. Yeah, there's no way we take a knock on that, right? Because like I can't even paint explosion. Yeah, there's no way to win, right? There's no way for me to win. Hmm. That's upsetting. 
Yep, we lost that one. Okay. Ah, <laughs> oh, man. If we had found the counter... St- even, yeah, we found the... No, we couldn't find the counter stadium. Hmm. So there's Aptos. Other RCS surprise. It's upsetting. I was hoping to knock out the active, the bench stone during that one turn, but we did, didn't get it. <sighs> That's how bad fighting is. Like, you just hit, like, the fighting matchup, and you just, like, lose, right? That's what happened there. Okay, so we'll go first, of course. Okay. All right. We don't have an energy right now, which is really bad for us. We do have a very, very good setup. I just need a time to get energy. Okay. You know, I'm going to ultra ball this one away because that's a bad art. It's a bad looking art. So we'll do this, 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 pass. I guess they'll trinity charge next turn. Dark energy to Sobble. With the quickness. Discard the Marnie. Yeah, the last game was just unfortunate, man. It's just unfortunate. It happens though. Oh, Zapdos, baby! Okay. Well, he can't attack with it this turn, so it's okay. We actually can watch out this too. It has 200 HP, so that's nice. Hmm. Okie doke. Sobble. Quickness. Moltres. Mm, this can knock us out with a choice belt. So that's a very cool thing now with choice belt with the Moltres. You can like take knockouts. So keep calling. Now, obviously, if we find the RC's V-Star, we're going to do this. So. We'll do that. Does this choice spin, choice belt matters? Yes, 100%. I have to put it on there because, like, uh -huh, I don't. Oh, goodness. Okay, well, let's. Hmm. Okay, so we're going to air balloon this. I'm going to ultra ball these two. We'll keep the hyper potion just in case. I'm going to go for the V-Star. I'm going to V-Star the bench. Star birth. For the barrel and the DTE. We'll... D to the active, put down the barrel, and we'll go for the sizers. Okay. And then from here, I'm just going to Trinity Charge. And put one, two, and a third one here. I still like what Artists is, man. Like, it's just so good, dude. You're like, okay. We couldn't, we didn't get the energy turn one, but we got the turn one turn, turn to charge. So, you know, it makes up for it. So, we'll see what they do here. I mean, they probably want to find a fighting energy and, like, go for Thunder's K for the knockout. But then, like, if they do that, then we send the Arceus, the Arceus take a knock on this thing. And then, like, he has to go for the Ultras V, which doesn't knock out anything. So, like, okay there. This is what becomes, like, really interesting. How many, how many Galarian Zeptos do they play? Do they play Clara, right? Um, can they find the fighting energy for it? Scoop up net this. Okay, so they scoop up net this, take a power of this up, put the Drazeal back down, find energy search, and be good to go that way. If they have a boss to go with it, they can knock this out, but then we're still okay. Hmm. We'll see what they do here. There's a lot of what ifs right now that are happening. So there's the energy search, which we knew, which can get the fighting energy. Oh, Shaman, can you come closer? Thanks, man. I appreciate that. So there's the energy search for the fighting energy. There we go. Okay. Fighting energy in the Moltres, or his Aptos, and then the Moltres is Aptos, Josh. There's a Sobble. There's a Dire Flame Wings. Love a ball for another Drizio, which should. It should find them the, um, 
should find them the ball sort of knock out the V star. There they go. I don't think they should go up to Gengar. If they go up to Gengar, whatever. Oh, they do go after the Gengar. Okay. That's, I think that's fine. I think I'm fine with this play. Yeah, I'm fine with this. I'm just not going to put another Gengar Remax down. All right. So now we got this. We got this. We can Sizers for two. Oh, for one, sorry. I don't know where I got the math from. And then we'll Marty them. Okay. Okay. So we can... Do we play the Tool Scrapper? No. We'll probably hold on to it. We definitely discard the Evolution Incense. Yes. Uh, I think we'll discard the Big Charm. We'll grab a Gengar. We'll go Gengar. Retreat to this. Trinity Nova for the knockout. Get the three dark. Put one here. And two on this thing. Okay. Now, do they have boss order? And um, choice band, right? That's two cards they need. So knock out this. We'll see. We'll see. So there's order to get back to Zapdos. Okay. Because this is not got this. That's good. If this, if this survives, we're good. We win. But that's kicker. Can it survive? So we're probably going to see a quick ball. Try to get out the Zapdos, right? Man, I shouldn't have benched this. That's what I shouldn't have done. I shouldn't have benched this. And then they have to commit two energies to that Zapdos. Yeah, that's what we should have did. Oh, well, you live and learn. Um, they, can't take three, they can't take three price cards. That's nice. That's nice. Okay. And this thing does have a two tree cost. Um... So we'll see what they decide to do here. See what they decide to do here. Okay, so the evolution to the shady dealings. Okay. There's a quick ball for Zapdos. Uh huh. Yep. Okay. This card's Aurora. A oh, very interesting card. Like I said, if they don't find the knockout this turn, we are in really good shape. But I mean, you gotta think with like evolution and sense. Oh, they got it. Very nice. Yeah, that was a misplay on me. I shouldn't have benched this. And then we could have made them find a switch, energy switch. Now, if... This is a lot. But if they just, like... <laughs> okay, never mind. Well, huh. Disregard what I was going to say. Okay. Man, now we got to figure what we're going to do here. Hmm. I think at this point we have to go the Gengar, right? And then we gotta hope that he can't power up this Moltres. I mean, it's not looking good for us. That's all I gotta say. Alright, so we go... Ultra Ball. Let's card one and two. Yeah, I think that's a fine. Grab the VMAX. We have one dark energy left in the deck. Um, we have to find the dark energy. Yeah, we have to find the dark energy. So we do this. We do collapse. We do industrial incisors. 
Oh no. No matter what this is taking a knockout, so we do this. We get thin the deck. Okay, we need this or this for knockout next turn. Or for this turn, actually, sorry. And we got a Marty and, and cross our fingers. So we didn't hit the right on. Or Dark Energy. And we lose! Alright, there we go! We did it! We lost! Alright. Um, because Trinity Nova only does 200. Cool. Alright. Alright, they need an energy. They they need an energy. Right? Which I imagine they might. Why wouldn't they have the energy, right? Misplay on my part was definitely drop the Gengar last turn because that means they needed an energy switch. So. So. Okay, that card does, is irrelevant right now. Mm-hmm. Cool. Okay, so we're gonna ping again. Okay. We're gonna ping here again. Yep. They can't do this three times <laughs> or four times, so that's good. Okay. So we're definitely going to switch. Hmm. I want to switch this and fear panic. So I'm going to go switch to here. I'm going to switch to here, right? Yep. We're on Dushnero Sizers. We'll Evolution Incense for the B-Barrel. We'll put down the B-Barrel. We're on Dushnero Sizers. Uh, we'll Quick pull away the RCS in this case. I don't know. Why not? And we're fear and panic for a knockout. Now, they most likely have game. They need energy and boss order, which they have two boss orders already discard pile and one fighting. Okay, now they can grab the Drizzile for boss order. If they play it, they might not have the third one. We'll see. We'll see. Maybe the third one's prized. Maybe they don't play three. Don't do this to me. Don't slow roll me. Don't slow roll me. Do you have it or not have it? Cause I'm gonna swallow you up next turn. If you don't have a boss order. Do you only play two boss order? Do you have a third one? And they can't attack with Zapdos cause they already attached an Aurora energy which is not energy switchable. Crowbat for five. Okay, Palpad maybe? Cross switcher? Okay. Reconstitute Articuno V. Okay. Marnie. Okay. Bye bye, double hyper potions. Shh. 
shady dealings? Okay. Just trying to see if they have something up their sleeve there, guys. Escape rope? Hope he's saving up a bee barrel? I don't know. I don't know. Switch a quick ball. So they're trying to just thin the hand right now. Um, which is fine. I wanted to show off the DTE Hyper Potion play, but Hyper Potion at the bottom of the deck, I probably won't be able to hit it. But if they smack the active with something, so switch to this. Okay. Lift the quickness. Okay. Ping me. Ping my Gengar. There we go. Okay. Boss order, choice belt, and we'll do max wall up. I don't know how we won that. I have no idea how we just won that. I have no idea how we just won that. We made some huge misplays by like dropping three Pokemon, but it paid off. We did it. <laughs> so there we go. There is Gengar Arceus. We didn't get to see the high potion, unfortunately. Uh, but yeah. I guess he only played the two boss orders, right? Maybe they played three. I didn't look at the list. They could have played three. Uh, but yeah, taste the deck. Uh, Drew said don't play it. He wouldn't play it again. So, but you know, whatever. Uh, like I said, check out the video down below. Check out that link. Did you watch the video yet? Did you watch it? Go watch it. Have a great Wednesday. See you tomorrow. Uh, hopefully for an interview. If everything pans out correctly. With uh, potentially the uh, Malamar player that got top 16. Alrighty guys, bye.